In our neighborhoods with the highest crime rate and the highest dropout rate and the least jobs are getting the worst food. Most of our country is fed by corporations, not chefs, you know? So, so the question is like, what can a chef do about it? How can a chef create change? In the ghettos of America, we feed our children corrosive chemical waste. What we're gonna do is we're gonna tackle the fast food industry. And we do it like we know how as chefs, we just get in and cook. I go by Poppy on the streets, and I'm from Los Angeles. In South Central Los Angeles, there are no chef-driven restaurants, not one. What if every high-caliber chef told our investors for every fancy restaurant we build, it would be a requirement to build a restaurant in the hood as well? Roy Choi and Daniel Patterson was the first person that came into our community since the 50s and kept their word. And Roy stole my heart when he gave me a couple of applications and asked me to go give them to people that couldn't read or write. And he hired them. I'm kind of the mother of Watts. Lydia is the mother of Watts, period. And they call me Mama Nisi. Uh, my name is Timothy Moore. I'm the barista here at Locos. We haven't had nothing like this in a while. The environment, it's just it's uplifting to see something positive going on in the neighborhood. The name Local, it's two concepts together. Local, like we're crazy to be doing this. And then local, you know, we're local. And so uh, that became local. They've been showing structure to a lot of the young people that never had jobs, never worked before. Now they're working and being responsible and taking care of business. I look forward to coming to work every day. It brought revenue into the community. It brought jobs into the community. It, it did a lot of change in our community. It's creating opportunities for a lot of people. So I want to be one of the people to be able to move up and to bring other people in and have the same opportunities that I have. No matter how people grew up, if you give them delicious food, they choose delicious food. There's, there's a myth about the choice that's given. You know, we're actually not giving that choice to everyone. Everything is made from scratch here in the back. Locos food is, some of it is organic, it's fresh every day, it's not something that's processed, it's, it's real food. A lot of people rave about the chicken sandwich. I like the chili bowl, the beef chili bowl. Chef Daniel and Chef Patterson has their own style. It's affordable. Everybody can spend two dollars or three dollars and get a full meal. You would think people would be scared to come, but when they do come, it's like, okay, now we we got something going. Is people want to come and be a part of what we have going on? Access to nutritious food is a fundamental right. You know, it's one that a lot of Americans don't enjoy. Now I actually enjoy what I do, and I still get the bills paid and having fun doing it. I love my job. I just love being a part of it. <laughs>